Hello everyone, Dave Landry here. I'm getting a few requests from both new clients and potential clients for a little bit more information on my trading service. So I thought it'd be easier just to make a quick video on that. Before we do that, let's take a look at the disclaimer screen. As you know, or as you should know, you can lose money trading. I like to sum it up by saying all predictions are about the future and a lot of stuff can happen between now and then. Also, everything that I do is for educational purpose only. Okay, now that we've got the disclaimers out of the way, my trading service is more than just a tip sheet. I give daily market analysis, daily sector analysis. I do give some direct recommendations, which is a tip sheet, tip sheet aspect of it, he tried to say. But there's a lot more to it than that, but most people are really focused on the results. So here's uh, some results I put together. This is the 100K VAMI hypothetical uh, model starting with 100K about 10 years ago. This is the S&P 500. Notice that the S&P began to sell off fairly hard in here. As you would imagine, that is the bear market of 2008. One thing that's kind of interesting is notice that the portfolio did begin to rise eventually from that because it is a trend following methodology and if there is a trend it will do fairly well now unfortunately notice throughout this period here we had a couple of flat years of the S&P where it just went sideways well just like you can't get a tan when the sun's not shining you can't catch a trend when there is none so the portfolio will underperform during that period but also notice that once the market begins to trend again the portfolio will do very well the methodology is swing to intermediate term we get in for a swing trade hopefully get a swing trade profit and we're willing to hang out with that position as long as it moves in our favor ideally if we get a position we want to be in that same position many years from now by the way this is the discretionary portfolio these are all the recommendations the direct recommendations that I made this does not include in the ancillary setups that I made over the last 10 years or so by discretion it means that if a stop gets nicked let's say if a stock gets exactly hit and the stock immediately reverses in that position we will stick with that position if it comes very close to initial profit target then we'll take those additional we'll take those initial profits uh, and then we'll trail a stop higher on that for more discretion uh, see discretionary rules on the service page if you need the article let me know also read the second half of the layman's guide to trading stocks and one other place to look the weekly webinars I spent a lot of time explaining exactly how to use discretion now let's take a look at my website and I'll show you where the service is and I'll show you a few things about it uh, if you go to my home page you click on trading service you'll get a little bit more information on this page and a lot of the things that I just explained are going to be explained on this page so if you scroll down you can see there's a lot of information on the service and also these are the fees down here including the introductory rate uh, to get in now let's take a look at what you get with the service well at first it doesn't look like a whole lot and this page admittedly is kind of bland but if you click here you'll get a daily video and if you hit play on this I don't know if the uh, that picks up too well in the mic, but uh, each day I do a short video on what's going on in the overall market. This is the actual portfolio from a few weeks back, and I used a little bit older one out of um, courtesy to my clients. This down here, these are the new stocks that I'm recommending uh, exactly where to get in, exactly where to place your stop, and then your uh, exact initial profit target. Now, again, we will use a little discretion around those. See the webcast and... Uh, aforementioned articles for more on that so I go through the entire portfolio talk about what's going on and then I take a look at what I call my Landry list these are ancillary setups for the next trading day I also talk about what's going on in the existing portfolio let me see if I can get to it good bad and indifferent and potential setups and this is Pandora this is actually an open position right now and we'll go forward with this and then of course I get to the overall market after going through the portfolio and go through uh, specific sectors where I'm seeing action in here. So each day I publish this video. If you want the last 10 years of these, just shoot me an email. I'll give you some information on those. And by the way, if you're looking for the actual raw data that I use to uh, put this uh, uh, spreadsheet together, uh, I'll be happy to give you that for the last 10 years or so. I've been doing this for a very long time, and the service has been up and running for quite a while so what are you going to get uh what do you get uh, you get a daily video of overall market analysis sector analysis specific stock picks 
when they they present themselves there are maybe times when there's nothing going on when that market does go a little flat and i'll back off a little bit and you won't see any stock picks whatsoever the ancillary stock picks that's what i call my landry list if you go to the service page on my website the marketing page you'll see that the, there's some talk about the, the landry list there in fact i've got a testimonial of someone who took a recent setup out of the landry list uh, teaching examples when relevant if there's something I could teach you in the market I certainly will show you uh, specific position management meaning how you know, a lot of people say okay uh, here's a stock and then you're like okay now what I'll show you once you get in what to do how to trail that stops how to manage that position and hopefully stay with it for a long long time and again discretion is very important so I will try to give you a heads up when possible about a discretionary technique let's say a stock is getting really close to being stopped out and the market's a little weak pre-market uh, you'll check me uh, check out on Twitter or, or sometimes even the night before if it looks a little iffy I'll um, let you know that it could be a discretionary type of call the other thing you can have access to the more recent archives if you scroll down on the service page you'll see the very recent archives those I, I hold for a month or so and then I give them out uh, to uh, to the general public but you'll have act direct access to those on a, on a daily basis as soon as you sign uh, the other thing you will have is direct and unlimited within reason access to me I put this within reason in here because there's only there's only so many hours in a day but you can ask me questions about any particular setup uh, that I recommend and get my thoughts on that and I'll be happy to help you out any questions about anything I've said so far DavidDaveLander.com. Also, if you need to talk to me directly, I answer my own phone here in my office, so I can get you that phone number. So just shoot me an email on that. Or if you go to my weekly webinars, I put my business card up in those, and you can check that out. So any questions, again, just shoot me an email at DavidDaveLander.com. Thanks, everyone. Happy trading.